everyone, this is Lost Kobold on YouTube, Golden Kobold on ECF. Uh, doing a quick one-two review here of a place and a juice. The juice is going to be a time fireball. The place is going to be Smoke and Vapor website, www.thatsnotsmoke.com. And it's in uh, Panama City, Florida. Panama City Beach, Florida, actually. Very interesting experience. First and only bait shop I've been to. She had a wide range of PVs. I thought she only had Enjoy from some reviews I'd read online, but when I got there, she had Egos, genuine Egos. Um, the E pipe you may have seen online, some stuff I'd never heard about before. She had Cardamizers, E2, Revision 4, and various colors. Just a wide range of Addies, everything you needed to get started and keep vaping. Uh, that's where it's at. You're going to need a, a local vape shop because you never know when your battery's going to die, your addies, all your addies are going to mysteriously die. I don't know. And to keep you from going out and getting a pack of smokes, this is fantastic to have one of these around to go to and be able to get what you need to keep vaping. So I was there, and since I didn't have to pay shipping, I got kind of a odd juice for me. Atomic Fireball, 18 milligram PG. Uh, I normally vape VG, but this sounded kind of cool, so I went with it. And very interesting juice. Let me get a drop in here. I'll be doing this on my Magma Addy, which is around 2.5 volts, in my Volcano Inferno. And 3.7, 650 ma. Um, very good juice. Nails the atomic fireball flavor right on. Got an interesting inhale. Real creamy and smooth um, on your tongue. Almost a, yeah, a creamy sensation on your tongue, which I wasn't expecting. But then that cinnamon hotness hits you. And it just all melts together into a, a really authentic fireball taste. It's kind of like between the center of a fireball where you got that sweet creamy center and the outer overly hot shell. You got that middle spot where you're getting a little bit of both. Nails it. That's what this is. And I've lent this to other people. They immediately knew what they were vaping. It's an atomic fireball. If you want an atomic fireball to vape all day, this is where you go to get it. Good vapor for a PG. The ceiling fan's taking some of it away, but you could probably tell the vapor is really good um, on this Inferno. The it's a little sweet for an all-day vape for me, but the cinnamon does help offset that. And even though it's not an all-day vape for me, it is one I I've been coming back to since I've gotten it. And I've mixed it with some menthol that I had from Liberty Flights, 24 milligram VG. And that was a really good mix. It made like a, it was like six drops of menthol to four drops of this atomic fireball. It made a very nice like fire and ice kind of mix. But even on its own, it's a very good vape, and it's definitely something that you can come back to later on in the evening when you want a sweet vape. So thumbs up on the flavor, 100% where it's supposed to be. Uh, vapor's great. Throat hits about even um, average for PG. 18 milligram, which is fine with me. I'm not a huge throat hit fan, and maybe I don't inhale it all the way to get the straight throat hit because I don't want it. But uh, thumbs up. Smoking vapor. If you're ever in the area, stop by, try out our stuff. If you want an interesting vape that's good, uh, get the Atomic Fireball. She also recommends her flu cured tobacco, which I have not tried, and her. Uh, butterscotch for uh, almost sweet taste which smells wonderful and I have not tried it. I do plan on going back and get some more for juices and maybe another box of these E2 Cardos. They're working pretty well too. All in all a great experience and thanks for watching.